Well, our top focus is, of course, the train tragedy from early this morning. The Rajdhani train derailment in Chapra. Was there an accident or was it a conspiracy? Railway Minister Sadhana Gowda will be visiting the spot of the accident around noon. He will be leaving for Patna at 10 this morning. Gowda has also called for a meeting of senior railway officials at Rail Bhavan. Speaking on the tragedy that has left four people dead, Minister Gowda has said that sabotage is definitely one of the things being looked at. And at this point of time, a high-level meeting is on as we speak at the Rail Bhavan, where ministers and agency officials from the Railway Board are putting together the possible reasons for this accident. Remember, Maoists had issued a warning that there could be disruptions and that they would disrupt rail traffic in the area by destroying tracks. Could it be that this was the reason why four Indian citizens are dead today in Chapra. It happened at about 2.09 this morning. This was a train that left around 9.30 p.m. from Delhi. These are the latest images from the site of the tragedy. Four people dead, at least eight people injured. The number is likely to be closer to about 25 people injured. Rescue and relief operations still on even as we speak. Well, a quick news update from Chapra. Just in three timer bombs have been found in Dariyapur. The bomb defusal squad has been called in to check out those bombs as well. Well, the spot, the, the spot where the bombs were found is 25 kilometers away from the train derailment place. Police, however, say that there is no connection to the train derailment. Remember, even at this point in time, Shiv, there are two theories that are emerging. While there is a rail minister who is on record saying that a case of sabotage cannot be ruled out, the member of parliament from Chapra says that it's too early to, in fact, indicate that this was sabotage. So it's going to be a while before any clarity really emerges on what exactly happened.